Hi, my name's Nathan, and I'm the owner of Donut King at Grand Central in Toowoomba. We're looking at starting our own business. We thought, oh, well, my background's hospitality. I've worked in restaurants and cafes. Sick of doing the nine to five, sick of working for other people. We stumbled across this by accident. It wasn't advertised as a Donut King. Started looking into it and then thought, well, no, this is pretty exciting. It looked pretty good. It was simple, and that was the important thing. It was just easy to do. The legal side of it or the franchise document and the leasing side, that is always difficult. I don't have a great knowledge base on it, but then because of that, I make sure I have a good solicitor, I have good financial people to tell me and advise me. That's the best way to overcome it. If you don't know, have someone there that can help you with that sort of stuff. My wife is my business partner, so she works in the business alongside myself. Mother-in-law comes down, she'll do a few dishes and help clear tables and stuff like that from time to time. The kids come in, they like to have a bit of a help. So yeah, we enjoy being a family business. We have flexibility so we can go out and play together or go and do things together or we come to work together. So yeah, no, it's good for that sort of thing, definitely. One of the things that attracted me to Donut King when I found out more about it was that they do have a very good training program. You do initial five weeks at the academy at the Gold Coast. We have a very good support system from RFG with online training, so the staff are always doing something on there. When new promotions come up, they've got to do some training for it so they understand the importance and what it is. Whatever we do, we try to support local businesses. We do a lot of work with one of the schools here where my son goes to school. We don't make a big deal out of it, but we just enjoy doing it. If you don't look after your customers, you don't treat them with respect and be pleasant to them and make them feel good, well, there's no reason for them to come to your store. And I'm very big on that. I like to have a bit of a joke with our regulars. It's important because they go then and tell their friends, oh, we're going to go for coffee. Let's go down to Donut King. Nathan always looks after us, you know. We get a good deal there. The staff are fantastic, you know, and, and that's important. If you don't have that, you don't have a business. The biggest hurdle you're going to have is getting people to understand or know where you are, know what you do. Franchising is great because it's already proven. The franchisors set up the systems, You've bought into that, so you know you're walking in straight away and you don't have to worry about anything. Look at something that will fit what your skill set is, and that's important. Make sure you understand what you're buying and what you're getting into. Make sure you have a good solicitor. Make sure you have a good financial advisor. We've had our hiccups over the time, and without the right advice, we wouldn't still be here. So definitely do your research and make sure you've got your support network ready to go when you first start.